just aired down and um, heading through the tracks. So we don't really know what's coming up first. Um, but yeah, not bad little track. There's a couple of little water crossings and they've had rain in the last couple of days. So yeah, but it's been pretty good. And we've got a mysterious ticking noise at the back. The leaf spring seems to be making a bit of a funny noise. So we'll see what happens with that. For now, we'll just keep bumping along the track. <laughs> So we thought we'd try, um, I think we run about 15 pound on all tyres on all both the cars and um, Dill's having a bit of trouble getting at the top so we thought we'd be right. The shady spots seem to be quite moist still um, but the dry stuff in the sun is very dry so we'll just take them all down to 10 and we should be able to creep up no worries. That was a pretty good little challenge actually. I didn't think it was going to be that bad. But um, yeah, 10 PSI when we both pretty much just crept up it. Pretty much like mm. no power at all, just idling. Super easy. Yeah. YouTube made it look so hard. But it yeah, was watched a couple of videos fun. before we come out and yeah, they made it look quite difficult. But the, um, yeah, like some other guys have said, the uh, if you take the right hand track when you're going uphill, that's much easier. Um, some guys like did it in road pressure or something they reckon, so but I'd like to see how hard they were going in the car. But yeah, we rocked all, well, Kobe rocked most of the way up it and I ran half the way up. So I am knackered and hot and sweaty. It is warm. I need a swim. I need a swim. Yeah. Oh, well, let's see what we get up to. Yeah. <laughs>
scrub, so it's not that bad. But if you are white, you are gonna get it. So we got stuffed around a little bit with accommodation because there's a, um, a concert on at the place we were going to book at yeah. and they basically asked us to relocate to here but they sorted it out all beforehand which is really good of them um, yeah. and they made it quite simple so we just called up these guys and said hey we've organised it with your friends around the corner and checked in and away we went um, but yeah this was a great little place like it was a bit dearer but like, yeah, it was they've 20, got twenty dollars a head. Yeah, they got canoes and um, um, a creek and everything. Like it's really cool. You can paddle down to the waterfall and check that out. It's yeah. just really cool little place. Heaps of like a couple of bushwalks, which are really cool, and they have a swing hidden in the jungle, which was pretty cool. Yeah, they got their own little um, their own restaurant and stuff as well, which is pretty awesome. So yeah, you can have a nice like restaurant style meal if you. If want to. It was really nice inside like. Yeah it was just cool like they've done such a good job of renovating that place. So manicured and yeah. everything as well. I can't believe how nice the grass was. Yeah. But yeah and then yeah we had a bit of drama with our compressor this morning because yesterday Gil doesn't have a compressor so we had to pump up eight tyres with a Kings that is Piece of shit about thumper. that many years old and yeah. it's a bit lacking but yeah we got them up to about 25 we crept into camp and we were like well we'll deal with it in the morning we tried to deal with it this morning it didn't work so um yeah we had to we just asked them to see if they had the compressor and sure enough they did uh, we found out what's wrong with ours the hose is split which is great so hopefully we can repair that and we can get a little bit more life out of it but we will be upgrading it asap i think that stupid compressor has ruined like three hoses now. yeah we've gone through a lot runs too hot so don't buy one. Kings gear, guys. Yeah, save your money, buy something good. And just for the record, we didn't buy it. It, it 
was already in the car when we got the car, so... Yeah, but yeah, don't really rate them too highly. No. They do work, and if you're using it once a month, then yeah, sure, but like, if you want to pump up a few sets of tyres, then no good. No. But anyway, that's enough rambling. So, where are we going now? We are going to Stanage Bay, Stanage. Um, it's a bit further north, and um, yeah, we're not quite sure, like apparently it's a great little fishing spot, like free camping right on the beach, there's a nice little general store there, and yeah, so we're just sort of excited to see. A lot of the reviews have said that it's quite uh, quite bad, flies, mosquitoes, and all the rest, so it doesn't sound too good at the moment. We've got our nature's botanical, we'll probably yeah. have to lather up with that, or whatever other fly spray stuff's in here, yeah. I don't know. Light a fire and hopefully that keeps them all away. Yeah. So we'll see what happens, but it should be a good little trip.